according to this book, the influenza epidemics in Europe and Asia, the first described is BC 1103, the epidemic in Babylon or Babyrus of the Persians. Next one is 722 BC, epidemic in Nineveh during the reign of Sargon, the king of Assyria. Then is 591 BC. Diodorus mentions a pestilence having occurred at that day, but it seems more like some epidemic meningitis rather than a flu. Then there is a epidemic described uh, in the year 395 AD. A pestilence claimed to be flu destroyed by thousands the soldiers in the Greek army in the siege of Syracuse, but it could be plague or cholera. Now, more reliable incidences is, is in uh, AD 827, a cough disease with fever spreading rapidly and widely, uh, known as Hedfid or Heafod Flowon, also as Sea Wolf epidemic in Britain. 876 AD, a disease attended with cough and fever, pain in the eyes, Atalier fibris, Italian fever, ravaged Germany and Italy. 888 AD, a disease with cough and fever spread through Germany. 927 AD, a disease with cough and fever epidemic in France and Germany. 996 to 97 AD, a disease with cough and fever epidemic in England. 1173, first epidemic or claimed to be the first prevailed in Turkey, Germany and England. 1323, the same countries invaded, spread to persons, towns and villages. Again in 327, the same countries. 1387, Jacob von Koneshova states in the Strasbourg Chronicle, a general pestilence invaded the whole country, attended with cough and fever, hardly among one among ten were unaffected. In 1403 and 1404 AD, epidemic over Europe. 1411 AD, epidemic name was given to the disease Li Tak, cause contagion in the air extensively caused abortions during convalescence. There was profuse hemorrhages from the mouth, nose and bowels. This accounts for the disease is given by Pasquier of Paris in 1665. 1414 AD, epidemic in France in February and March, names given to the disease Li Tuck, Li Horion and the Cocalushi. The authority is Lobinu. 1427 AD epidemic, widespread in France and continent of Europe, name given to the disease Ledendo. Symptoms, cough, insomnia, renal pains, anorexia and rigors constantly. The greeting everywhere on meeting friend was, have you had Ledendo? This was a description given. 1510, the first pandemic, all over Europe, first accurate description given of its prevalence in British Isle, mild in type, names given in France, Cafele Qatar and Kokeluki, in Britain, Kokolushi. The authority is Mr. T. Thompson. In 1557 AD, it came from Constantinople, very fatal, spread to USA, 
ravages Paris in July and August, Spain in August, England in September, and Holland in October. Distinctive symptoms tightness and dreadful oppression over the chest as if bound with red hot chains. The same sensation over the abdomen and stomach. The authority of description is Thompson Herman. 1562 mild epidemic, 1563 mild epidemic, 1580 pandemic 2 started on the north coast of Africa in Algiers and Morocco in May also in the island of Malta spread to the USA the authorities for Sika of Madrid England ravaged in August September October and November Rome 9000 people died Barcelona Cadiz Cordova Seville Madrid and other Spanish cities are said to have been depopulated the Spanish physicians bled their patients. This vinisection is said to have been very fatal. Those who were not bled most lived. Thomas Short, London, 1587, states on page 9, All had the coqueluche. Few died except those who were bled or had unsound viscera. Anna, wife of Philip the One of Spain, died of the disease. Pope Gregory the Eighth was given up for dead but recovered. Then there were epidemics in 1591, 1593, 1597 and 1626. In 1647, Noah Webster states, for the first time influenza is mentioned in the history of USA America, but it must not be concluded in the absence of earlier records that the disease never occurred in the USA. Webster also cites cities from Hubbard, quote, the disease swept the southern states and the plantations. The West Indies were ravaged and had extensive mobility on each of the islands of Barbados and St. Kitts. There were 5,000 to 6,000 cases. 1658 epidemic in Europe started the end of April. Thomas Willis, MD of Oxford, says the cause of the disease was a blast from the stars. 1675 epidemic ravaged Germany. 1688 epidemic began in May. Europe swept great mortality in Britain. 1693 epidemic Europe. 1709 epidemic in Europe, France, Germany and Italy chiefly affected. 1712 Europe epidemic began in Germany. Fever, cough, sense of dread and oppression, painful eyes and great backache. Rapid spread, great and prolonged exhaustion, morbidity great, nearly everyone attacked, mortality very light. 1729 to 1730 origin Moscow, Russia. April 1729, morbidity enormous, lightning-like spread. In London, great mortality, barely 1% escaped. In the month of September 1729, over 1,000 people died each week. Rome had some 60,000 cases. Authority is Han. 1732 to 33, this is the third pandemic, raged over the entire earth spread to U.S. America October 1732. In 1742-43, La Grippe and Influenza appears as names given to the disease for the first time. Epidemic, great morbidity, few deaths. Next is 1758, the flu prevailed as an epidemic in France, Scotland and West Indies. 1761, present in the USA in the spring. 1762 epidemic in Europe, 1767 USA America began in the month of May, 1775 to 76 spread from Europe to USA, authority is Gluck. 1780 to 81 January 1780 started in France, 81 to 82, this is the fourth pandemic. Very severe, wide, very severe widespread began in autumn of 1781 on the borders of China and India 
and then spread to Russia and USA. In 1782 appeared in Western Europe the name given in this pan pandemic was Russian Qatar. The British fleet sailed from the Channel ports Plymouth and Portsmouth on May 6, 1782. No further contact was had with the land, yet on 27th of May the flu broke out on the fleet. Note, the presence of flu carriers on the ship or infected stores, clothes or other fomites and only opened after a week or two at sea. Also, a flu being epidemic at the ports of departure will amply count for this alleged miracle. Note by the author. 1788 to 89, widespread epidemic in the USA, according to statement of Webster. Influenza is not spread by infection. Sailors on board ship ships 100 miles from land and insulated as to infection were attacked. Uh, this was thought at that time. Obviously, it is spread by infection. 1799 to 1800, North uh, Eastern Europe epidemic, 1802 was the fifth pandemic. 1807 was the sixth pandemic. 1830 was the seventh pandemic. The seat of the outbreak was Manila. In September, it spread to the USA. 1833, epidemic in Northern Asia, Europe, North Africa, in St. Petersburg, great morbidity, none escaped. 1836 to 1837. This is the eighth pandemic. Starting point obscure, but in Eastern Hemisphere, morbidity and mortality large. Pulmonary influenza or influenza pneumonia cases very common. In London, for the week ending 24th of January 1837, there died 1166 percent and for the week ending January 31 the death rate total reached a total of 1169. These deaths were solely due to flu. 1847 to 1848 was the pandemic 9. Point of origin unknown, center of focus of the disease, the eastern hemisphere and the Europe especially. More females than males were attacked. Great mortality of those affected with the disease, there died. 83% of the children, babies and infants. 104% of those of 15 to 60 years. 247% of those over 60. Authority is peacock. In Paris, one quarter to one half of the population was attacked. Uh, the figures of percentages is a bit difficult to understand. In Geneva, one half of the population was attacked. In London, 250,000 cases were said to be stricken. US and America escaped the disease. In 1850 to 51, 57 to 58, 73 to 74, 75 in 1879, Influenza prevalent in both hemispheres. In 1889 is the 10th pandemic. Started in Bukhara in Russian Turkestan, large province, situated to the east of the Caspian Sea. March 1889. Very vicious in its morbidity and spread acted as never before ran over the whole globe in a few months. Contagus, which hitherto in doubt was clearly demonstrated by this epidemic which spread from Asia to Russia. Americas were infected from both Siberia and Europe, tropical and temperate countries, mountains and plains were all swept over alike. Pandemic 11 is 1918 to 1920. This is the one which is most famous and often quoted in the modern books. Origin in southeastern Spain, Barcelona, a seaport, April 1918, where a German submarine is said to have carried it, originally acquired by this boat at the Baltic port or port of Danzig or Staten, swept Europe and entered Asiatic Russia, later Japan, US, America was infected at its Pacific and Atlantic ports. 
the conditions of the trade and commerce during World War were unusually favorable for carrying of influenza to the USA. America, the great soul, as always, acted most generously, putting herself on short rations in order to feed the starving millions of the world and send her ships with food and clothing to the flu-infested ports, carrying back the disease to their own people. To date, a number of epidemics in Europe is 47, pandemics is 11, that is 1920, up to 1920. And names for influenza are Italian, Cataro, Russo, and Infolenti. In Portuguese, Cataro, Epidemico. In Spanish, Cataro, Epidemico. In German, Blitzkrieg, Lightning, Qatar, and in German, Influenza. So I have uh, quoted you uh, from uh, this book and uh, uh, which basically shows that uh, and this book which was written by History of Influenza episode by Dr. A. Moritz, PhD, physician, Honolulu, Hawaii, USA in 1921. Um, this was uh, uh, this also lists the influenza epidemics in the USA. Let me quote them. AD 1557 appeared in America, spread from Constantinople, very fatal, 1580. Pandemic 2 spread to America, 1647, for the first time mentioned in the history of America, swept the plantation in the south. 17, 22 to 23, pandemic 3, October 1732, appeared in Connecticut, followed in day, following day in Massachusetts, Annapolis two days later, attacked 50% of the garrison in 1760. In 1761, appeared in spring, northern part of USA, Philadelphia, Massachusetts, and Weymouth. 1767, appeared in the month of May, 1775 to 76, epidemic in the USA. 1781 to 82, pandemic 4. Very severe, widespread, appeared in spring, began in East China, thence to India, Russia, Western Europe, named the Russian Qatar, appeared in USA in April 1782. 1788 to 89, prevailed extensively in the USA from 15 to 45th degree of latitude and spread over this area in 6 to 8 weeks. 1807, generally disseminated throughout the USA. Pandemic 6, November 1831, reached, reached America, seat of outbreak Manila, as mentioned before. 1843, very prevalent in New England in the month of June, 1850-51, epidemic in the USA. 1873, prevalent in the state of Pennsylvania, Ohio, Virginia, Illinois, Iowa, Michigan, Wisconsin, Minnesota, Missouri, Alabama, Louisiana, and Texas. 1874 to 75 reoccurred in all the above states. 1879 epidemic in USA. 1889 pandemic 9 began in May. 1889 in Bukhara, Russia, Turkestan, one of the worst pandemics ever known, ran over the whole globe in a few months. America infected from both Siberia and Europe appeared in New York at the end of October 1889. San Francisco infected from Japan, December 1889. Then 1918 to 19, the pandemic 10 began in southwestern Spain in April 1918, spread to USA in May 1918. White morbidity prevalent all over the states, pneumonia very fatal, severe and fatal, especially in the training camps where it swept off numbers of flowers of the American youth. To date, Date the number of epidemics in USA is 17. Total number of pandemics in USA is 5. Uh, because of the COVID situation, uh, I felt that I should draw this attention to this old book. And uh, I hope that the information which is contained uh, is utilized if of some use and uh, the details of the book have been given. Thank you very much for your patience.